Hey guys, what's up? So I'm back today with another Wig Wednesday video and I got my hat on today trying to be real stylish or whatever. But anyway, so the wig I'm showing you guys today is from the Silk is from the Stylist collection. So this is a silk top lace wig and it's a 4x4. So you do get like a good amount of parting space at the nice tippity top of the wig. Now this is in the in the style Swiss Goddess and it's the color F1B30. So instead of me going for black this time, I kind of went in for color just because it's summer. I'm trying to do color and I'm trying to do something different. Now specifically for this unit guys, this is a synthetic unit so this is not a human hair unit like I've been reviewing so I'm kind of throwing these into the mix right now because you guys love when I do those really affordable units so if I'm not mistaken this one is less than $50 and you get four inches of, you get a four by four which is that four inches four inches of parting space which is amazing so um this is definitely something I would check out on samsbeauty.com now I'll link everything down below for you guys but let me show you guys exactly what the unit looks like so in the beginning when I got the units, I was a little nervous because I was like the color, I thought that the highlight was a little bit chunky and I didn't want it to be chunky like that because it doesn't look real. But this one, there's ways to part it so that for, therefore you don't get that chunky look from the highlight. Now it is about an 18 inch long unit and it does kind of have like that, it looks like they bumped the ends of the unit so it's like nice and bumped at the ends. It is a very, very nice African American textured hair which I just that is one thing I love about synthetic units that are like this. If some synthetic units have like that African American texture, I definitely go for those first. Now, like for instance right here, you'll get like a chunky highlight right here, but it's not that type of chunky highlight where it's kind of plasticky and fake looking. This actually looks pretty natural. It looks like a blowout. So I'm excited about that. Let me show you guys what the parting space looks like. So this is the parting space right here it does come with two combs right here on the side it comes with one in the back and adjustable strap as usual so i'm definitely going to utilize this part and see what i can do i'm probably just going to do like a really simple cute hairstyle and keep it real cute and simp just because i'm not that type to do all that extra crazy shit that's just not me and you guys already know that if you guys been following me for this long so i'm going to cut the lace over this one i'm definitely going to put some baby hairs around the perimeter and try to make it look cute i'm really excited to to try this one out with the color I just think it's gonna look fabulous so yeah so if you're interested in seeing what this unit looks like today I would like you to stay tuned and keep on watching guys.
shout out to samsbeauty.com for sending me this unit. And I also want to give a huge shout out to the stylist company. This unit is A1. Now, I'm not joking. I'm not making up. The guys, you guys can just see. Where do you see synthetic wig on the... This is... I don't... Like, oh my God. I, like, I don't even know what to say. Because this is definitely probably one of the best synthetic units I've had thus far. This shit goes hard. Now, the last unit that I reviewed that was synthetic had color in it, and I thought that was like the infinity and beyond of, of colored units that I would try. Now, I took a risk with this 1B30, but bitch, it is coming through full throttle. I... You cannot tell me that this hairstyle, this wig itself is not on point. And to make things even better with this unit, it comes with 4x4 four four parting space. Like, why? Like, and you know what's funny? I've been reviewing so many human hair wigs. I kind of, I kind of forgot about my synthetic wigs. But when I put this on my head, I was like, wow, Dom, you have really been missing out on the game. I absolutely am in love with this wig. Now, if there was a human hair duplicate of this shit, I would wear this unit every single day. That's how freaking amazingly flawless this wig is. Now, the wig is a little bit dense because it is that has an African-American texture. So if you're trying to detangle this, definitely use a wide tooth comb or a nice paddle brush. My paddle brush works perfectly fine. I'm able to detangle this baby with no issues. As you guys saw, I did go in and cut some baby hairs. I cut a little bit of, you know, hair on the side here to make it look more um, human hair-like. But it does look human hair-like, so I didn't really have to go that far. But just for styling purposes, I went in and did that. Now, guys, please let me know where you see an imperfection at in this unit. This unit is fucking fabulous like i've really been missing my synthetic wig uh gang my synthetic wig review so i definitely am coming back with some of those too human hair is popping and all but synthetic wigs are definitely where it's at it's very inexpensive very fucking affordable and look at less than 30 dollars i mean not less than less than 50 dollars and you are looking like a goddess you know like oh my god this is a joke like this has to be a joke like this is this I'm, I'm completely satisfied i will leave everything down below for you guys in regards to this unit i will leave the color store like everything like this is absolutely amazing i am so so happy and now i feel so rejuvenated like i can order more synthetic wigs and do more synthetic wig reviews just because the game has really stepped up now I don't, oh my god, I don't even know what the fuck to say, yo, like, and one more thing I'll say, I know you guys always put this as a joke in the comments, like, I just kind of, like, whip the powder on my head on the parting space, with powder, I don't use wet concealer just because wet concealer looks real messy, so I use face powder or, like, um, contour powder and I just like slap it on the part I slap it on the corners here and the inside part here if I'm depending on if I want to flip it over like that to do kind of like a cute overlap overlap hairstyle so that's why you guys will see me just dropping powder on it I feel like when you just put that powder on it looks more natural instead of looking fixed like the concealer so that's why I do that so guys that's basically it for this hair do not forget to thumbs up this video leave your comments down below hit that subscribe button and also share this video with your friends and family and I will catch you guys in a later video bye guys